Hi guys, I'm Sean from Burn Photography and I'm here to show you how to use the tone curve in Adobe Lightroom. I've edited my image to a certain point and now I've got to the tone curve. The tone curve, it allows you to modify various light levels that you can find within the image. A bit more bespoke than the main sliders. So if you like move the highlights within the tone curve, you can see especially in these clouds what parts it's affecting instead of the whole of the image. So I'm just going to lower them slightly because they're a bit blown out. Lower the lights ever so slightly. Add a bit more light between the shadows and the darks. I'm going to select this section here and I'm going to add three anchor points by just by clicking down. Once the three anchor points are added, if I drag and pull up the bottom left hand slider, it creates a faded look to the image. It gives you a more vintage film look. It's what I use on pretty much 90% of my images and it's very popular nowadays within photography. I hope you found this informative and thank you very much for watching.